check the accuracy of the equipment, we can actually go through and perform a calibration check. To do this, we have to access the main menu. From the main menu, we go into maintenance. From maintenance, we scroll down to calibration check. The machine will then prompt us to place the calibration weight onto the magnet from underneath the machine. Once the weight's been placed on the bottom of the machine, it's as simple as pressing enter. Without disturbing the machine, it will then prompt us to remove the weight from the bottom of the machine. Once prompted to remove the calibration weight, we press enter and the process passes. If there is a calibration issue, it will fail the calibration test. At 68 kilos of refrigerant usage, the machine requires a filter change. It gives you a warning at the 45 kilogram mark that this needs to be performed. You need to access the filter maintenance program from the maintenance menu. We press enter, it actually prompts us of how much refrigerant capacity we've used and do we want to replace the filter now? If we decide to change the filter, we click on enter. We connect the service hoses to the storage ports and open the couple of valves. This is to remove any refrigerant from the filter circuit. The filter assembly screws and screws straight back on. Just to ensure the O-rings are seated correctly. Once the refrigerant's been cleared from the filter circuit, we need to enter in the serial number on the replacement filter.